what difference does it make i'm sure narrowing down the question what difference does it make if the contract is notarized rather than having a proper agreement with that is stamping etc does it make any difference um <clears throat> notarizing uh, is not compulsory in our law he refers to i mean if it's an international situation then perhaps the law of another country with which a party is contracting or the the person in another country with which a party is contracting might require notarization and if that is the case it might be necessary notarizing only adds um, i would say one more layer of um, credibility to the contract one thing is that if you and i have a contract and we both are happy notarizing it that's very good both of us feel more bound by our signatures if it is notarized there is also a small presumption i say small because that may not always be applied a presumption about uh, signatures if a particular transaction is notarized but otherwise notarization i mean if you are happy notarizing no problem but the law does not require notarization i would also request nitin kumar ji to go to civil law uh, just google civil law notary and common law notary civil law notaries let us say are notaries in the european countries not not uh, england uh, they have a much larger role to fulfill in fact you will find that some notarized documents can be effectively enforced as if they are a decree there's no need to go to court so they have a larger role to fulfill whereas notaries in india or the common law systems they are more for the purpose of uh, just uh, lending authentication to signatures 